Warren, how would you define true success? Well, I've, I've said many times that, that, that if you get to be 65 or 70 and later, and, and the people that you want to have love you actually do love you, you're a success. In the annals of finance, there are moments that defy eras. And in 1991, the financial world teetered on the edge of chaos as Warren Buffett, the maestro of investment, found himself at the heart of a storm threatening to shatter Wall Street's foundation. Imagine a titan of finance walking a tightrope, his decision echoing through the corridors of power. Today, we will unravel the gripping narrative of how Warren Buffett's strategic acumen and unyielding resolve were put to an ultimate test. Nearly rewriting the playbook of global finance in a year that held the fate of markets in precarious balance. Warren Buffett, a legendary investor and CEO of Berkshire Hathaway, is often hailed as the Oracle of Omaha, revered for his investment prowess and sage advice in finance. However, in 1991, Buffett faced a storm that nearly shook the very foundations of Wall Street, sending shockwaves through the financial world. To understand how Warren Buffett almost broke Wall Street in 1991, it's crucial to delve into the events leading up to its tumultuous period. The early 1990s were marked by a series of events that created the perfect storm for Buffett and Berkshire Hathaway. Buffett, known for his long-term investment strategies and valued-based approach, had built Berkshire Hathaway into a financial powerhouse by investing in undervalued companies and maintaining the diversified portfolio. However, in the late 1980s and early 1990s, Berkshire Hathaway faced a significant challenge due to his holdings in the insurance industry. During this time, the insurance industry was grappling with substantial losses stemming from various catastrophes and a volatile market environment. Berkshire Hathaway, with its insurance subsidiaries, such as National Indemnity Company and others, was not immune to these challenges. One critical issue that exacerbated Berkshire's situation was the fallout from its investment in Salomon Brothers, a major Wall Street investment bank. In 1987, Buffett stepped in to help salvage Salomon Brothers after a scandal involving improper bidding on U.S. Treasury Securities rocked the firm. Buffett's intervention in managing the crisis at Salomon involved becoming its interim chairman. Buffett's involvement was pivotal in stabilizing Salomon Brothers, but this move exposed Berkshire Hathaway to significant risk. Salomon's trouble continued, and by 1991, Buffett faced a tough decision regarding Berkshire's investment in troubled investment bank. In an unprecedented move, Buffett disclosed in Berkshire Hathaway's annual shareholder letter in 1991 that the company might incur a loss of about $100 million due to its investment in Solomon Brothers. This revelation sent shockwaves across Wall Street and rattled investors' confidence in Buffett's judgment, leading to a widespread speculation and concern about the future of Berkshire Hathaway. The situation worsened when Solomon Brothers faced another crisis, this time related to a treasury bond scandal. It was revealed that traders at Solomon had submitted false bids in treasury auctions, causing a major uproar in the financial markets. Buffett faced immense pressure to take action and mitigate the losses stemming from Berkshire's involvement with Solomon Brothers. His reputation and Berkshire's financial stability were on the line, and the uncertainty surrounding the situation created a cloud of doubt among investors. In response to escalating crisis, Buffett took decisive steps to protect Berkshire Hathaway. He negotiated a deal with investment firm Travelers Group to sell Berkshire's stake in Solomon Brothers, effectively distancing his company from the troubled investment bank. This move helped Berkshire limit its exposure to Solomon's tumultuous situation and mitigate potential further losses. Despite the challenges and turmoil caused by Berkshire association with Solomon Brothers, Buffett's astute decision-making and ability to take swift action played a crucial role in steering Berkshire Hathaway through the crisis relatively unscathed. Moreover, Buffett's transparency and willingness to address the situation hand-on in his annual shareholder letter demonstrated his commitment to honesty and accountability, which helped restore investors' confidence in Berkshire Hathaway over time. Warren Buffett's association with the Solomon Brothers scandal in 1991 cast a shadow over his esteemed reputation as a savvy investor and ethical beacon of the financial world. Initially criticized for not intervening sooner to mitigate the fallout, Buffett faced scrutiny and skepticism regarding his judgment and leadership. His proximity to the Solomon Brothers debacle raised questions about his oversight and decision-making, challenging the perception of Buffett as an infallible investment guru. The tarnishing of his image as a result of this crisis marked a rare moment of vulnerability for the Oracle of Omaha. Buffett's resilience in the face of adversity and his steadfast adherence to ethical principle helped restore faith in his integrity. His willingness to confront challenges, take responsibility, and navigate the crisis with integrity and candor earned him renewed admiration. In the aftermath of the Solomon Brothers scandal, Buffett's reputation gradually rebounded. He emerged from the tumultuous period with his integrity intact, reaffirming his status as one of the most respected and influential figures in the world of finance. The fallout from Solomon Brothers was a wake call that resonated deeply with Buffett. 
it prompted a fundamental revaluation of his approach, emphasizing the critical importance of continually assessing and mitigating risks in his ever-evolving landscape of finance. This experience instilled in him a newfound sense of vigilance, urging him to delve deeper into risk assessment and management strategies to safeguard Berkshire Hathaway's interests. More significantly, the scandal reinforced Buffett's unwavering commitment to ethical investing and doing the right thing, even in the face of adversity. It reaffirmed his belief that integrity and ethical conducts are non-negotiable aspects of successful and sustainable business practices. Buffett's journey through the Solomon Brothers debacle reinforced his conviction that ethical lapse can have far-reaching consequences, not just financially but also in terms of reputation and trust. His resolve to uphold ethical standards in investing, regardless of prevailing market pressure or temptations, was strengthened by the tumultuous chapter in his career. The episode became a guiding principle for Buffett, shaping his future decision and reinforcing the importance of adhering the ethical principle in this pursuit of financial success. It propelled him to be even more vigilant, prudent, and uncompromising his commitment to ethical investing practices. The Solomon Brothers scandal reverberated far beyond Warren Buffett and Berkshire Hathaway, leaving an incredible mark on Wall Street and triggering seismic shift in the financial industry. The egregious misconduct uncovered at Solomon Brothers sent shockwave throughout the financial world, prompting a widespread re-evaluation of the practice and ethics within investment banks. It served as a stark reminder of the potential pitfalls of unchecked greed and unethical behaviors in the pursuit of profit. The fallout from the scandal ignited intensified scrutiny and calls for reform within investment banks and financial institutions. Regulators, stakeholders, and the public demanded greater accountability and transparency in trading practices, risk management, and overall governance. This watershed moment became a catalyst for regulatory reforms aimed at fortifying the integrity of financial markets. Regulatory bodies, including the Security and Exchange Commission SEC, and other global regulatory authorities, implemented stricter oversight measures and regulatory frameworks to curb malpractices and ensure more robust compliance standards. Investment banks faced heightened scrutiny, prompting them to reassess their internal controls, risk management protocols, and compliance frameworks. The emphasis shifted towards fostering a culture of accountability, prompting ethical conduct, and enhancing transparency in all facets of the operations. The Solomon Brothers scandal acted as a catalyst for a paradigm shift within the financial industry, ushering in a new era characterized by greater emphasis on ethical behavior, regulatory compliances, and transparency. It compelled financial institutions to re-examine their practices and prioritize integrity as a cornerstone of their operation. Furthermore, the aftermath of the scandal propelled a cultural shift in the perception of ethical conduct within the financial sector. Investors, stakeholders, and the public increasingly demanded ethical accountability and responsible business practices from financial institutions. If you've enjoyed this journey through financial history and want more fascinating insight, don't forget to hit like, drop a comment, share this video, and subscribe for a treasure trove of engaging content. Stay tuned for our next exploration into the intriguing world of finance. Until then, may your investment be wise and your adventure in the markets be as thrilling as this story. Bye for now!